And we're back for before and after for free solo. So sad, you can't see it. The camera sucks with lighting. But basically, they don't even have a poster for this. El Cap is the most impressive wall on Earth. It's 3,200 feet of sheer granite. It's the center of the rock climbing universe. Obviously, I get interview questions about it all the time. Oh, would you like to do that? And you're like, yes, for sure. Uh, I love Elizabeth Chai and Johnny Chen comes back after May Rue 2015, and we're back for free solo. And it's gonna, I'm just going to expect crazier things. Because from production, I heard it's been a real wild ride of them filming this. Jimmy Chin said he doesn't even want to do free solo sort of documentaries because it's just like, what if he dies? So definitely looking forward to that. And just apparently, like, even though if you know how it ends or what happens to him, you still like on the edge of your seat type of thing. So look forward to that. Granted, it might be less like cinematography in terms of like, oh my goodness, this looks so crazy and luscious or whatever. Because with Meiru, there was a lot more scenery. But here, I think it's gonna be okay. We got a, you know, clear cut drop wall and all that stuff. I still look forward to all that action. And I'm uh, definitely looking forward to this time of uh, the dual returning, like the couple, the married couple of these National Geographic film distribution. So yeah, look forward to it. Definitely deserves to be seen in theater rather than at home. So definitely am excited and pumped. So uh, that's it, and this is before, and this is after. Wow, that. That was great. Well, first of all, the projector light bulb was kind of flickering, so it flickered for the entire film. And my 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 brother and parents did not notice for the entire film, and I, it bothered the crap out of me. It bothered me, but holy crap! Like great work as always. I mean, may ruin now this. This was filmed like wow. And and Alex, holy crap! Free solo. This run was amazing. Just like the personality and just like just the story behind it of him figuring out why he's the way he is and then he does this climb, he does it for like his reasons and it's just holy smokes like like just mind boggled. Like I it was stressful to watch at the end, it was so adrenaline rush and all that and and it was just wow. Like just just lost for words really. And yeah, the cinematographer was great. I mean granted it's one location I guess it's different because Meiru is just sort of like this vast sort of like this pillar of shark fit and ice. Here we jump around different locales and there's less of a narrative in a sense. I mean with Meiru there was three, three storylines somewhat but here it's just with Alex and he, he goes and does his thing and, and, it's just, and it's just wow. I'm just gonna say wow like this is, this is an experience that you need to experience like in the theater watch it just just how they build the narrative of those climbs those sections and that was just great it, it was just really good really great stuff i cannot wait to see what jimmy chin does next and his wife it's just wow just very wow and 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 yeah i just lost the words because it was just like what a spectacle it's like <laughs> this is real and he literally climbed off a sheer drop like those millimeters of like footholds, handholds, and it's just like wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, that's it. That's all I'm gonna say. So this is before and after for freaking free solo. Great stuff. Check it out. Support it. I mean, the run's gonna be a pretty short because it's not a movie for your main audience basically, so support it if you can. I'm gonna definitely get this, like, owned. Owned for sure. Anyways, this is before and after free solo. Later.